Hello, my name is Eddie Tofbeck. I'm Head of Technical Analysis and Senior Markets Analyst at ADM Investor Services International Limited. Here's your daily technical analysis of Brent Crude Oil and Spot Gold. I'll start with Ice Brent Crude Oil Futures. A higher but still indecisive spinning top yesterday, coming as it did a day after the previous session's reactionary bullish white soldier managed to punch up and out as well as closing over the combined overhead resistances made up from, and this is in no particular order, the rising short medium moving average, currently 108.12. The congestion era, originally from July 2014, that stretches from 106.79 to 108.62, as well as the downtrend line of the late March to date descending triangle, currently at 107.24. I can only echo what I said yesterday that perhaps, just perhaps, the market is beginning to make a choice or choices between the recent actions since the start of March being either a lopsided double or triple top or as a possible again lopsided cat's ears pattern or finally what may well turn out to be true a pair of descending triangles one within another. For the larger of the two triangles it's way past make your mind up time so it may well be that all the we've been waiting for is the break of this second descending triangle which happened this past Wednesday. And we shall see, as we've had two consecutive closes over, but to be honest, it's not inspiring. And it still could be a false break on the upside. However, just get ready, just in case. So far today, not much. Uh, a move up to the lesser Fibonacci level 113.04, and just below the lesser Fibonacci level uh, uh, 111.06. Um, interestingly looking potentially like we might be trying the top side again but I'll wait and see on that one it's not inspiring just yet spot gold a long-tongued indecisive spinning top yesterday as the market pierced the overhead resistance of the rising medium moving average currently at 1884 but for a second consecutive session failed to close over it meanwhile below we had interesting support from the 50% Fibonacci line of the March 2021 to March 2022 move at 1873. Overall, even with this spike higher, the market is still traveling down in between the upper time above, currently at 1918, and the middle time below, currently 1823, of the early March to late April bearish Andrews pitchfork. So far today, a dip below the 50% Fibonacci line, but then a move back up to test the medium moving average. Potentially looking like a possible hammer, maybe. Thank you for listening. This short version broadcast gives you essential market patterns and consequences. Please be aware of the risk disclaimer posted with this broadcast. Copyright Eddie Topic and ADM Investor Services International Limited. And here comes the final bit. 